morning vlog. It is 8.30 in the morning. The sun is shining. Woohoo. <laughs> we are in the beautiful Litchfield National Park in the Northern Territory. And Yigal is very excited because we are going hiking, but not just any type of hiking, overnight hiking for the first time yeah. we've ever. <laughs> we have been trying to pack our bags for the past like hour and a half. <laughs> we thought this would be easier than it is. Shockingly heavy, <laughs> I've got to say. Um, but we're nearly ready to go. So that's good. We thought we were ready to go until Wes realised he hadn't packed any water. Wes has got his kit ready to go. I'm just packing away all of our valuables so that no one robs us, hopefully, while we're gone. Obviously the Ultra Boosts, we don't want those on display. Pit vipers, definitely not. Alright. Goodbye, Van. It's a bit scary leaving her. That's what we're doing. Nice. Let's do it. Alright, so definitely a case of all the gear. No idea at the moment. As you can tell by me looking like a park ranger. We've had a couple <laughs> of foiled attempts here you know, overnight hiking. Which basically means that I've been stockpiling gear for like months now. <laughs> So I'm very excited. Bam. Forest balls. Amazing. Uh, okay, so this is what we're meant to be doing. There is fires burning. But it did say, it said online. Information said it was open. Yeah, so, uh, it. <laughs> Stuff number one, we have done 12.6 k's, three and a half hours. Definitely ready for a swim and some food. Yum. We're here, we got a campsite. <coughs> you can camp overnight here. And it leads down to this beautiful the watering hole. Pat going back on. Am I ready for it? I don't know. It's gonna happen there. Mm. All right, we're gonna go. I'm going bush bashing. I'm trying to find a shortcut. Will we be successful? Oh, I don't know if this is a good idea. <laughs> Trying to shortcut was indeed a bad idea. We are heading back towards the trail. So far we've gone from here to here, chill down there, came back. We gotta get to here today. 15 k's. <sighs> How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm pretty good, I'm feeling alright. I might be a little bit tired, but we got a long way to go. The upper way is very hard with the backpack. We're dying, taking a break <sighs> in the sticks, <laughs> harder than we expected. <laughs> as soon as I stand up, my legs just hurt again. <laughs> the view, kind of pretty, Wes and Sarah dying. 25 k's on the clock. Like the I ride the bush camp, camp, yes. Bush camp, bush, bush camp. Bush camp. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. Oh. 25 k's of hiking. 
We did. We underestimated it. Yeah. But we had bush camp. Thank God. Camp tour. We got metal thing. We got toilet. We haven't checked out toilet yet. We got fire pit. You know, where's it? Ching his dick. We got sand pit. Here we got sort of a view. Alright, let's try and set up this thing. not be as fancy as the van but I thought I'd give you the tent tour <laughs> this is where we go we got the Oz Trail hiking oh, tent person, yeah. to my crib. inside <laughs> what do we got big ass opening for your big ass <laughs> <laughs> this big ass yeah. we got we, two of the finest sleeping bags from Kmart <laughs> we got two of the finest sleeping mats from Kmart no pillows but you know We'll make do. We're using our jumpers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and other than that, that's it. Feed update. Crook. Crook. <laughs> All right, you can't really see it through the camera because the camera is shit. I'm shit at using it. But the sunset looks super pretty. <laughs> and where's is getting the fire cranked to the max. Good morning vlog. Um, yeah. Last night was interesting. We'll give you some reflections when we're on the trail. Um, yes, in summary. <laughs> but shit. we've just decided because our feet don't hurt as much this morning, we could actually investigate. Like our tent's just over there. We're over here, and there's actually a really nice view. We were just too tired to go and look at it yesterday. So that's nice. Also, half of last night's drama was not having enough water and we didn't think it was a water source but as soon as I arrived here I can hear, don't know if you guys can hear it it's running water <laughs> very close as the sun comes over the area out there gets more and more lit up so it's fascinated Alright, we're nearly at the water. What's it gonna be? <laughs> oh, it looks nice. What? Oh, it's beautiful! <laughs> we're idiots! and water, drinking water which we didn't know existed until right now this morning ah, this is so beautiful I've just had a swim I feel so much less disgusting we've both drunk like a liter of water after nearly dying overnight having a few sips Filling our water up. Lovely view. Wow. How our night would have gone differently <laughs> had we walked a couple of extra hundred meters. All right, packs are on once again. Bush camp. Adios. You would have been much, much nicer had we known there was a beautiful waterfall just over there. So we didn't actually mention yesterday that we decided to do the trail backwards uh, for ways that most people don't because it's a circuit my dumb idea um, and <laughs> had we done this the right way around we would have passed this on the way to bush camp yesterday the fuck <laughs> Sarah's a revolutionary <laughs> Sarah said to me before we left, she's like, Wes, I've got an idea. It might be revolutionary. Let's do the trail in reverse. You know there's like that ring of just dead trees in the middle? Yeah. Another lovely water source on this morning's hike that we could have done with yesterday. Trying another 
attempt a bush bashing to shortcut? Will we be successful? <laughs> Very difficult terrain. Okay, we've escaped that grass hell. Still not back on the path though. Yay, we're back on the path. point in the overnight hike we're going to try a hitchhike <laughs> back to the car it's 20 k's from here we'd have to do another 20 we've done 30 yeah and i'm <laughs> so if you're wondering why we're hitchhiking last night was not the best um, we couldn't sleep, <laughs> in, in summary. Turns out, overnight hiking, very heavy to carry all of your stuff. That's one thing, it makes hiking a lot harder. And secondly, sleeping on a little foam mat and a $30 Kmart sleeping bag, not as comfy as I expected it to be. Not at all. I had really assumed we would be able to sleep. So, yeah, spirits were super low this morning. We also like didn't have any water last night because so we didn't end up consistent. So now, I have to cop this. Oh yeah, it's gonna be catastrophic. We are back no at the old gal. I want true love, the van. Well, I may have failed, but at least I have a what? snow cone to drown my sorrows. And here we are, back where we began. All right guys, we're back in our home, the van. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed that interesting vlog um, of us being idiots, basically. But uh, we did see some nice things. Uh, if you enjoyed, please 